Welcome back to Bags on the Go. So, I want to give you an update on the 79 Impala. Alright, so, it's on the road. And we're going to start here in the front. So, what I did, I went and replaced this headlight. Just went in my stock, grabbed the bulb. I had to also put a new bulb down here. Um new windshield wipers have to have new windshield wipers then this bulb was out put the new bulb in there so now all our bulbs are working so when i'm driving a car i ain't gotta worry about a spotlight being out everything works and the front end looks a lot better now that that headlight matches the other side because it was black it had water in it too so now she looks good and she's on the road so next um, i couldn't deal with that hot rod exhaust so i took it down to the exhaust shop down the street and there go a resonator and do 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 i put a put a muffler on it a quiet muffler too there's nothing special Nothing's going on with that muffler. It's not a flow master. It's just a quiet factory muffler. And there goes tailpipe. And that's how I dumped it out. So you don't see it. So now when I'm cruising, it's so smooth. I don't hear no exhaust sound. I can hear the motor now revving. So when I take off, it just, you can just tell that motor is so strong. This car is a champ. I've been driving this car now for four days. And I've been from Livonia, Southfield, all the way to Oak Park, all the way to uh, Royal Oak, all the way up Woodward to Pontiac. And I'll tell you, she rose. Ooh, she rose. I just wish that it had some AC. Because I'm a kind of person that likes to roll with the windows up with the AC on when it's hot and right now I'm not able to do so so I got to crack the windows but really not all that bad been enjoying the car I, I, I just love sitting in this big Caprice box Chevy ain't nothing like it. it's a big car the G bodies is smaller so B body is just a it's, a, it's a difference. You gotta, you gotta already know how this is. It's a lot of space in this car. Okay. So, I've been cruising. So, um, no lights is on on the dash. Cigarette lighter thing don't work. Figured that out yesterday when I tried to bring a charger in to charge my phone. Uh, this radio is so old, I don't even think it'll charge iPhone because I plugged my iPhone up and it said not available. So that didn't work. And then this radio, a speaker up there working, a speaker up there working, and that's all I got. But at least it's something. But it's quiet. It's quiet. It's not, uh, it's not loud. I don't have no speakers in the rear working. And I haven't even tried to hook them up. I just... I just cruised the car. Last night I had my headphones on when I went down Woodward. So we're on the road to turning all the way over. So when is that zero? Zero, zero, zero. And it's a fresh new start. It'll be at 100,000 then. So let me turn it on so you can hear it. So now on the inside of the car, you don't you don't hear nothing. It was so loud before. She got a nice little rumble too.
so smooth, so smooth. Let me, let me hit the gas so you can hear that motor. So even though I have LS swap cars, being in this, it's like a vacation away from driving LS. I don't feel the need to be like, oh, I wish I was in my LS right now so I can drive fast. This car runs so good. I'll just be cruising. I'm right at home. It's a vacation away from LS and that boy Rose. Now, I don't know if it's a 305 or a 350. I asked the gentleman that I bought the car from, what motor do you think is in the car? Or, or he, if he knows, he said, 305 but I don't know we'll figure it out we'll figure it out but just wanted to bring y'all that update I am driving the 79 as I planned and that's what I've been driving to Woodward took the slingshot one day and I've been in the Impala El Camino the Caballero not ready Malibu is at home with a sickness, a brain sickness. <laughs> so uh, I'm fixing on that. And hey, y'all, after after Woodward, it's, it's smooth selling. I got a couple more car shows to try to attend. But other than that, if I can't, I can't. It's time to hang it up. It's time to get to work. I got to put this Lincoln together here pretty soon and get that out of here. And uh. I'm thinking on the Impala, you know, wait until November. Yeah, probably wait till November before I try to tear anything apart off that car because I'm just, I, I just love driving it right now. Just, that's, that's, I just, I like the Aerocoupe. Amer ain't nothing like Aerocoupe. Nothing like a Caprice Aerocoupe. I think it's, you gotta know, you gotta know. So, Hey y'all, it's been going good. Bought me an amazing car. I didn't even test drive it and make sure it was even drivable. I just went with my first gut, like uh, I buy it as is. I put it in traffic yesterday on Woodward in the car. Didn't hesitate in um, back to back traffic. Ran strong. Um, all around good car good car surprise me i'm telling you that surprise me so there goes the update on the car y'all i'll catch y'all on the next one peace Nice that is. You don't hear nothing. Just move. 